Hello, my name is Scott Guscar, and I am pro staff with Cisco Fishing Systems. And in this segment, I'd like to share with you our downriggers. Um, here you see our electric downrigger uh, reel. Uh, they come standard with either a three foot boom fixed or a telescoping boom that will go anywhere from three feet to six feet. Um, the package does include two indexable rod holders that are built um, from our standard tube offerings. Um, let me come up here to the front. You can index them that way. And then you can also lift up on these and give them a quick rotate as well. Um, other nice feature about this, you'll see that the base is modular. This allows you to actually move these rod holders from the forward position of this downrigger and actually move them aft. So if you don't like reaching over the motor and the electronic controls and everything else to, to pull that rod out of the rod tube, go ahead and move this piece to the back of the, the downrigger. We do have a built-in line counter on here to give you an idea of where your downrigger ball is. As far as mounting options go, you can see here that we have it mounted in track. You can go off of a four inch um, base plate as well. Um, quick release um, mounts are another option. Now, personally, I have my downriggers on quick releases. So one thing that I like to do is to buy an extra base plate for those quick releases. And what I do with that base plate is I will go ahead and mount that on my wooden shelf in the garage. So at the end of the season, I can snap my downriggers onto the shelf and I don't have to worry about them falling over and getting tipsy. Um, so that's a nice little feature that I like about that. Um, wiring is fairly straightforward. We're gonna include a section of uh, flexible wire here that you can terminate into a fuse panel. Um, one of the other common questions that we get is how fast do these balls retrieve? Um, we will retrieve a ball at 175 feet per minute. Another important feature on the downrigger is that our booms are stowable, so you don't have to worry about them hanging over the edge of your boat as you're um, either departing or approaching uh, your boat dock. Very handy feature here, you're gonna pull that out, lower that down, and you can then begin to fish. Now, another important feature that we have on our downriggers is we have thrust and ball bearings in this swivel down here. Our anchor pin is also tapered so that it will wear evenly over time. Now, what is unique about this is that when I have a downrigger ball deployed, say it's down 100 feet when I'm fishing the Great Lakes, I can actually pull this arm out and rotate this downrigger with that ball deployed. I can get it out of the way to fight a fish, to net a fish. I do not have to remove that rod out of the fishing zone. Very nice feature to have. As always, if you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call or you can find out more details at fishusa.com.